Tuesday. This is Knowledge is Power. I am Alita, the owner of the Funky Monkey, and this is how it looks today. I am in my roller skates. I am in my workout clothes, and I am doing all the things. I just took photos. Um, this is just how I, it works some days. So um, this is the series where we give away a $25 gift certificate for, um, I know it's over there, I'm going to get it, for a person for dropping a um, emoji before Christians tagged you up up top, Ashley. Al Moranes, you're, you are this week's winner. This is you. We've tagged you up top. If you know this person, you have two weeks to come and play, claim your prize. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for playing with us. Drop something below to let us know that you're there. Okay, so today I'm going to kind of talk about where I would begin as a beginner. So I'm going to begin that with people come to me on a regular basis. They reach out to me. They call me. They email me. They text me. They stop by the store. They, they have conversations with me about the possibility of putting their teenager or their child on a cannabis um a CBD cannabis product. I am not, I am going to not address that on this segment right here. I am not a doctor. I am not a pediatrician. I am, I can only tell you what I know. I can only tell you things that I've read. I can only tell you things that I believe, but any of these things, you have to do your own research. You have to make your own decisions. Talk to your pediatrician, talk to your spouse. Um, when I am working with teenagers, I like to talk to teenagers. I like to tell them what it should feel like in their body. I like to, just like I would be having a conversation if they were doing taking um, an antidepressant or an anti-anxiety medicine, there's rules about taking um, cannabis products. So I'm going, I, having that said, teenagers have been a topic of high concern. Um, recently, they went through the Rona too, if y'all didn't know that. <laughs> so as adults, if all of us are having a mental breakdown and we are struggling with getting back to the normal, guess what? Teenagers are the same, y'all. They struggle too. And, and we have to help them through that. So today I'm going to talk about beginners. Um, any, a beginner can be anybody that has not used a cannabis product on a regular basis. If I'm talking about teenagers, um, nine times out of 10, when they come in and see me, they've already used a cannabis product and it didn't come from me. That every time their parent either knows or they don't know, but Nine times out of 10, the kid will stand here and be like, yes, I've already used cannabis products. So we have a conversation about that. What does the difference look like? Same conversation I have with an adult. Have you ever used a cannabis product? And they all look at me like, is she really like gonna ask me that out loud here in the store? Yes, that's what we're here for. That's what the knowledge part of it is for. So when Christian, myself, or Alan, um, Chris sometimes, Grace sometimes, are addressing people that are brand new users to cannabis products, we're going to talk about a couple things. First of all, you need to have knowledge that this is your endocannabinoid system. Chris, Christian's way better at explaining this to me. He made me some notes, and I'm going to try to explain it to you. He may have to tell me a little bit of, to, to correct me as we're doing it. But this is truly your endocannabinoid system. It is in your, it is in your body. It's always been in your body. It's not in your health book, but it is in your body. Um, it can't... Um, everybody's system has endocannabinoids in it. The question is the link to, does that link to anxiety? Does that link to depression? Is the lack of cannabinoids in your system? Do some people just have more? Do some people have just have less? That's where the research is needed. That's why we need cannabis products to be legal so we can get into that research level. So all that we know right now, I'm going to give you, I'm going to cite something out of, um, the medical news today. Um, like th that's the source. If you'd like the, um, link, we can give that to you. I'm going to tell you what they say for a beginner user of CBD isolate things that you might, um, they might be used to, to treat. Again, I'm not a doctor and I don't, I don't, I'm just reading you what I've read somewhere. So it can use, be used to help with appetite. It can be used to help with mood. It can de decrease pain, inflammation, anxiety, OCD, ADHD, ADD. Okay, are there other, can you get on Amazon and order a supplement, a serotonin and dopamine supplement to treat ADHD? Yes. Right, okay, so we're still talking about all natural things here, right? So it may boost your immune system. It may um, counteract the formation of tumors. It may reduce vomiting. It may stop seizures. By the way, that's something that's already been approved in Texas for medical marijuana. So is PTSD. So if you if you want to spend the big bucks, like like five hundred dollars for a consult and two hundred and fifty dollars for for a quarter of an ounce to go get medical marijuana right now, PTSD, 
and um, seizures are on the, that list of approved things here in the state of Texas. Um, it can also be, um, there's also some connection between your serotonin reuptake inhibitors. That, that's something that's going to, that's a very complicated system, but it definitely affects something in your serotonin, which affects sleep, anxiety, and depression. So the thing about an isolate, when we've talked about an isolate before, isolate means iso, iso single, right? All by itself, alone, stands alone, not together. Um, so an isolate, when you take CBD by itself, that's exactly what you're taking. It's one of about 200 known cannabinoids. It's one of them. But it does have a lot of research to say that it is um, linked to reduction in stress, reduction in anxiety. The nice thing about it, and what Christian was saying is, and this is true about a lot of cannabis products, and this is why people that do it for a long period of time just don't get high anymore. They, they use it for the benefits of feeling calm, but they're, they're not walking around buzzed because they've helped themselves in a non-recreational way. So with an isolate, your body can only handle as much as it can handle. So if your kid eats two of them and it was 50 milligrams, but their body can only metabolize 20 milligrams, well, that's all that it's gonna, when the receptors is full, it's done. It, it, and that's what makes it a very safe product in my opinion. Again, I'm not saying that I'm a doctor. I'm just saying from personal opinion, I have zero problem. We have people of all ages that take isolate products. It is a very, very beginning point. I like where to start people there. The gummies last a long time when you chew them. They can feel the effects of them. Uh, we have some pretty common questions. Why don't you come over here, Christian, so that I don't have to hold them all up. We have some common questions about when people come in. These containers right here that he's showing you, this is just one flavor that we have, right? There is no difference in these, these containers, except for this says 250 milligrams, 500, 700, 1,000, um, 3,000. That's how many pieces are in here. That's how many total milligrams. That's the same way a bottle of isolate is. So the other form outside of a gummy, sometimes we do with kids if they hate gummies or if they're trying to explain to them, they're trying, sometimes kids with seizure disorders or um, family members that are unable to feed it to themselves and they need to put it into a liquid for them. A lot of times people come in and see this isolate like this. This is a very beginner product, just a little bit of calm, just a little bit of calm. Now, if you're talking to me personally, I'm always gonna tell you, you should pair it with a full spectrum. I call this the multivitamin of your um, cannabis lineup. It's the way that it comes out of the plant. It's exactly the flowering part of the plant. They pull out the um, cannabinoids out of it, about 180 of them, and they put them into an oil or into a gummy. This is your multivitamin. This is what helps fill this system every single day. This is, oh my God, I'm still having anxiety. I need a little bit more help. The long-term effect is to get enough of this in your system and get it in there regularly that you don't need to get out of jail for free. Now, having that said, are there people that take a multivitamin and still have a vitamin D deficiency? Yes. So sometimes the combination of these two together is exactly the way um, that it would be. This would be my ideal, if you came in and talked to me, my ideal pairing, you would walk away with a box of full spectrum and you would walk away with some type of um, CBD. If you were coming to see me specifically about anxiety, about restlessness, about now, do I know that it treats these things? No, I'm not a doctor. I'm not a doctor. I've told you that a hundred times. I can just tell you what I read, what I know, what I've studied, what I've taken, what I've done for myself. Um, I've used this very regularly. I, I've been very honest about my struggle with anxiety. I use cannabis products every single day. Chris always makes me say, follow that with four to five different types. Just to give you an idea of what it takes to fully manage um, a, a somebody that has been on antidepressants, somebody that's been on an anti-anxiety medicine, somebody paper, I do. I mean, I, that, that, I, I, I'm always gonna be ADHD. I cannot sit that long. Does this help with the everyday functioning? Yes. Does it not make me feel drugged? Yes. Does it help me keep it at bay? Absolutely. We do appointments every day by walk-in. If you want to speak to me specifically, you can message um, any one of my staff and they'll put it on the calendar. They have access to that calendar. Um, the more you know, the more you we can have conversations, right? Knowledge is power. It's a thing. If we're not talking about it, your kids are already talking about it. Your teenagers are already talking about it. 
You want to know who's talking about it? Old people are talking about it. They're already doing it. Come let us be a knowledgeable source that can help you get products that work. Make sure that they're clean crafted. Um, they say what they are. They have lab sheets. They're legal in the state of Texas. All of the things. Um, have a great day. Remember that word of mouth is our best way that we get away with um, selling cannabis products. Send us your people. Let us talk to them. Share this video. Do all those things. Send it in Messenger if you don't want to put it on your main feed. Um, we appreciate you. Christian's going to cough his head off in just a second. He's been done so good holding his allergies behind there. So I'm going to let y'all go. Have a great day, and we will see you on Thursday for New Product Live. Bye.